Since you can use multimedia broadcasting service from any place at any time, even while you're on the move. Terrestrial Digital Multimedia Broadcasting, TDMB, is called TV on Hand, or My Own TV, and it has come into the spotlight recently. The TDMB Broadcasting Service allows you to enjoy high-quality images and CD-like music while you're traveling at the speed of 300 kilometers an hour or faster. Like TV or radio, it uses frequencies transmitted by a transmitting station on the ground to provide services. TDMB basically provides digital audio broadcasting services, which are based on digital audio broadcasting technology of Europe, DAB, and the digital video broadcasting services, which have been newly added. The enhanced service, which provides data related to TV broadcasting, and the standalone service, which provides data separated from TV programs, are available as data broadcasting. If the auto GPS navigation system is combined with the real-time traffic information service, the location-based services like tourist information, as well as the shortest path from the origin to destination according to traffic condition can be possible. Also, the TDMB provides website services like the Internet. In combination with the mobile communication network, it can provide various bi-directional services where all types of viewers can participate while on the move. Furthermore, since the TDMB can be seen any place at any time, it is valued as the most optimum medium for emergency broadcasting. In addition, low-power TV service which provides contents for designated persons in the local area is possible. Since light DTV system is spotlighted as an alternative which provides digital broadcasting service on a level with DVD, the TDMB services are expected to create various business models. As the TDMB becomes more popular throughout the world, the number of its users exceeded 2 million worldwide in 2006. And in 2010, it is estimated to reach 17 million. Also, as service sales is expected to increase according to the increase of the users, the total sales amount of the TDMB services is expected to reach about $1.1 billion in 2010. Since TDMB is based on the DAB technology of Europe, providing video broadcasting service is made possible in areas where the DAB network is already installed if only DMB encoder equipment is combined. Therefore, its investment expenses are much cheaper than those of DVB-H and MediaFlow, which additionally require an installation of additional infrastructure. Also, as TDMB can use the existing DAB frequencies, it has an advantage of securing frequencies for servants, compared to DVB-H and MediaFlow, where separated frequencies need to be assigned. Furthermore, since the TDMB covers a 70-kilometer radius with low 2-kilowatt transmission power, it can provide service for a large area with fewer number of transmission systems, and it is very efficient in electric power. In addition, as the TDMB is expected to be adopted as the ITU standards in 2007 after it became the standards in Europe, it is more highly recognized for its reliability than any other competitive technologies in the world. TDMB service breaking down the limits of space and time is leading the convergence of broadcasting and communication. TDMB is leading the dawning age of ubiquitous computing as information requested is conveniently accessed from any place at any time. <laughs>